Hey y'all, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today is Wednesday, November 4th, and today I am going to be filming a vlog. So we are actually here in Park City, Utah for a little bit of a family vacation. I am here with Cody, as well as my mom, dad, and my brother, Michael. And this week, we could not ask for any better weather here in Park City. The highs are in the 70s, the lows are in the 30s, and the day we leave, the temperature isn't getting above 30 for quite a while after that. So we have some beautiful days here in Park City, and I am going to bring y'all along with me. Check out the view from our condo. It is absolutely beautiful out here. I cannot wait to go out and do some exploring. Obviously the first order of business this morning is making a cup of coffee. So normally I use liquid stevia in my coffee, but I forgot to pack some. So I did find these stevia in the raw packets and I am just going to use that instead. At least I found some option in the counter here. So I'm gonna pour those in. I had a tricky time figuring out this coffee pot this morning, but I did in fact succeed. So I'm going to pour myself a cup. Ooh, I'm gonna need to brew another pot. And going to top it off with a little bit of heavy cream. I just feel like coffee tastes so much better on a chilly morning in the mountains best time to drink a hot cup of coffee. My breakfast this morning is a little bit random, but I've got some bacon that we cooked in the oven, some strawberries and blueberries, and then this is like a little salami roll up with some cheese in the middle. So I am going to snack on that, and then I think we're gonna get ready for the day and head on out. Well y'all, we are dressed and ready for the day, so we just all hopped in our minivan and we are headed towards Park City. I think first stop on the agenda is the Visitor Center, and then from there, I think we are going to go check out the Park City Olympic Park, is what I think it is. So, let's start our day. Our first stop of the morning is the Utah Olympic Park, which I believe is the U.S. Olympic training site. So behind us is the Welcome Center. We are about to head inside, check it out, and see what there is to do here. Over here is the Olympic freestyle pool where the people training can come down the jumps and land in the pool. So I assume this is if they're training new skills. Oh my gosh, look at this tiny little chipmunk. How close can I get before he... Oh, there he goes. Oh, he's so cute though. We've got Mom and Michael over there riding the mountain sports simulator. Pretending like they are doing some powder skiing. <laughs> We got Cody over here doing the jump simulator. Oh, is he gonna land it? Is he gonna land it? Oh, he landed it, wow. <laughs> All right, we just pulled over to some trails and we're gonna do a short little hike. Get our blood pumping this morning. It's beautiful out here. We've been hiking for about 20, 30-ish minutes. Didn't do the whole two and a half miles, but still enjoying this beautiful day Park City is having. We got Cody behind me, say hello. Hey, y'all. <laughs> and yeah, what a beautiful day it is. I love all the aspen trees out here. We're seeing people go by on mountain bikes and you've got to have quads of steel to go up these hills on a mountain bike. Whew. Yeah, I need to get in better shape to try that out. But we're just out here 
Doing a little walking. What pretty views out here. We are here the perfect time before winter really kicks into high gear here in a couple of days. So we just got to the main street area of Park City and I absolutely love this post office right here. I think it's so cool. Look at that. This downtown Main Street area is the cutest little area. And I think we're about to go have some lunch at a pizza and noodle place. Michael has gotten his heart set on it. So it looks like that's where we're walking to right now. We are out here walking around Main Street in Park City. So we went and ate at a restaurant and I have got to say it was probably one of the worst restaurants I've eaten at in a very long time. So I hate that for us, but we should have looked at the Yelp reviews before we walked in and saw that there was two stars with 600 reviews. Anyways, I don't even want to mention the name of the restaurant because it was so gross. But we are just walking around. Cody and I just bought ourselves a Park City ornament woohoo to commemorate our trip here and i don't know where my parents and brother went but we're just enjoying this incredible weather uh, looking see if there's anything we want to buy we are just enjoying our time it's so pretty out here just wandering around main street so i was kind of thirsty so we just went into this atticus tea and coffee house and here's what I got. All right, so I was thirsty here in Utah. It is so dry and this chai latte that someone was drinking when I walked in just looked really good. So I got a little chai latte. Ooh, that is good. Yum. Ooh, very chai. Oh. After pretty much walking the whole main street, my parents came and picked us up and we are actually here at the Park City Ski Base. So there's some snow over here, so I have to go throw a snowball at Cody. <laughs> Woo, y'all, we found snow. This is definitely artificially made snow. You can see they have snow guns over here and behind us. So this snow is definitely not made from the sky. It's made from their artificial snow machines. But still, Cody hasn't seen snow in a while. So we came over here and we're about to throw a snowball at him. Y'all ready? All right. This is more like ice versus snow, but you know what, it's okay. Afternoon workouts. <laughs> oh no, oh no, oh no. no. Let's see what Cody's snowball making skills have to say. Let's see, can you hit me? Can you hit me? Oh no, oh no, oh no, that's a really big snowball. <laughs> Good thing he doesn't have very good aim. Hit me while I'm running. Hit me while I'm running. <laughs> Don't run again. Try and hit me. Try and hit me. Try and hit me. Oh. Slow down. <laughs> he didn't hit me. I'm too fast. I'm like a cheetah. Don't do it. <laughs> Don't get I No! Right. No, not the hair. We're too next. Oh no! You want to see if the, we can get them the vernacular at, at Deer Valley? My hands are freezing. <laughs> I can't wait to come back here next year, and we're gonna do some skiing here in Park City when this is totally white. All right, y'all. We're here at the St. Regis here in Deer Valley, and we're gonna take the little funicular up and. Look at the pretty views, because why not? All right, time to go ride the funicular here at the St. Regis. We got everyone here in the funicular, and we are starting to go up. The funicular. Yes. Oh, yeah. It's fern. 
Furnicular? I don't know. We're yeah. close enough. Let's well, see. Bright. We made it to the top and as you can see, there's another one coming up right now. Just like a two minute ride, but it's still kind of cool as a way to get up to the top of the hotel. We came over here to the Deer Valley base as well, and we're just checking it out before the sun goes down. They've made a lot of snow and we're watching these guys over here they brought their skis and are just hiking up the mountain and skiing down these little bunny trails. Too funny. <laughs> well, we are back at the condo and our plans are to just do some major chilling this evening. I am currently sitting on this incredible sectional sofa. This is the best sofa I have ever sat on and I want it in my home. But I thought I would do a little walkthrough of our condo that we're staying in because it is unbelievable. So here is a little tour of where we're staying. I thought before we mess up the place, we can do a little bit of a tour because this is probably one of the prettiest condos I have ever stayed in. Not only is it beautiful, whoever owns this place did a outstanding job decorating it. So I am going to take y'all on a little tour of the place. As soon as you walk in the front door, you're immediately greeted with the living area. So we have the dining area, the upstairs living area, as well as the kitchen. And this place is beautiful. Here in the kitchen, it seems like everything is brand spanking new. This place has got to be just recently built because everything is pristine and in great condition. We've got an oven, a gas stovetop, a big refrigerator, of course, a sink, dishwasher, coffee pot, toaster, so anything that you could need while you're here on vacation. Also, it comes fully stocked with anything you may need, like glasses and plates, cups, literally all that you could need while you're away. Right off of the kitchen is a full-size washer and dryer. And back into the kitchen, you come over to the dining area. There is six chairs here, perfect for family dinner nights. It's got some bar stools over here for more seating. And this is the upstairs living space. So you've got a couple chairs, a couch, and of course, a beautiful big screen TV and a gas fireplace. We even have a balcony out here with a gas grill, but it is dark outside right now, so you can't see our view. Check out this old antique ice box that is in here. How neat is that? Off the kitchen, there is the master bedroom. And y'all, this room is fit for a king and queen. This bed is huge and beautiful. There is a bathroom right off of the master bedroom and it is beautiful. So you've got double vanities. Hello, my beautiful friends. And there is a big soaking tub. And this shower is unbelievable. There is two shower heads one on each side and look there's a big full-size mirror right here but behind it hides the toilet oh that's cool the light pops on when you open the door but that's a neat little way to conceal the toilet and you get to see my beautiful face oh i want one of these mirrors how nice is this <laughs> and over here there is a master closet as well well, that is about it for the upstairs. So let's go ahead and head on downstairs. So we're gonna go back through the kitchen and head down the stairs. So there's actually a extra bathroom right here. In case you are staying downstairs and don't wanna walk downstairs, there is an extra bathroom. And now let's go ahead and head down the stairs. 
down here there are two bedrooms and a big living area as well as a hot tub so let's start exploring there is a small little bathroom with a toilet shower sink etc oh this is another really pretty shower these are great showers in this house over here is an office that is also a guest bedroom. This is a Murphy bed, so it folds up into the wall. And this room also has a TV and another full-size mirror. All right, heading out of here, we've got a big living space with Cody chilling on the couch down here. Say hello. Hey, Watch Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> oh, very nice. But look, there is two TVs down here. Over here, there's some towels because right outside of this door is actually a hot tub. If I can open the door. You have views of the city and there's a hot tub right there. I'll have to show you all the views during the daytime. But this couch is... Um, the most amazing couch I have ever seen. That's it is nice. so soft and comfy and big. I have wanted a sectional for forever. But like I said, just look at all the decorations in this place. They did such an awesome job. And finally, the last stop on our tour is the bedroom I am staying in. This has a queen size bed in it. And the decoration is a little bit interesting. There is this dress in the corner. I wish they had the story behind this dress because it is a very pretty dress and it's on display. So I wish I knew what the story was behind that. But this is just a queen bed and it does have an attached bathroom with double vanities as well. Hello, here's me again and a awesome bathroom. So another big old shower and a deep soaking tub and toilet. Well, y'all, I hope that you enjoyed the tour of this beautiful condo here in Park City, Utah. I will be sure to leave a link to this condo down below so you can check it out if you are interested. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this tour and I will see y'all again real soon with another video. Bye, y'all.